And welcome to the Personal Golf Simulator Studio, a professional, accurate and fun way to practice indoors. I've connected the laptop, the projector and the launch monitor, so now we're ready to go and hit some golf balls. Yeah, that looks about a go. But the materials used for the frame poles are high strength and very durable, meaning it provides a very stable frame for our personal golf simulator. They use this spring snap technology, which means each pole will click into place, provide a very secure fitting and it also means you don't have to use tools when you're assembling the frame. So here we have the high density enclosure fabric. The benefits of this, it will make the image clearer on the screen by blocking out light from the sides, but also when the ball hits it, it will cushion the impact and therefore keep the player safe and stop the ball flying back out behind the simulator. So this three layered impact screen will help reduce the sound as the ball hits the screen and it will also stop the rebounds of the ball. So when the player hits the ball, the rebound distance is reduced and therefore keeping the golfer and the player very safe. Because of the three layered function, it can withstand over 100,000 hits, making the screen very durable. But then when you do need to swap it in and out, because of the fabric and the Velcro fitting system, it's easy to replace the screen. So taking the screen out and replacing it with the new one. So this protective padding will absorb any impact from the ball and therefore protects the ball from hitting the framework and bouncing back towards the player. It's a very soft fabric and it's attached to the fabric and also the poles with the use of a Velcro system. So in the corner, we've folded the protective padding just over to make sure it fits nice and clean and tight in there. And then in this here, the artificial turf will curl up the sides just so it's protecting against the frame. So it's another level of absorption when the ball hits it and it will stop the ball rebounding towards the player. Here we have the protective side netting and some of the benefits for this is that especially for beginners or those new to golf, it's going to catch the ball that's slightly too left or slightly too right. And also if you are practicing indoor, it's going to give you the confidence in the safety of this product. Now we're at the back of the simulator, I'm just going to show you this high density fabric which is used as a protection cover, like a second layer of defense just behind the impact screen. If the ball does travel through the impact screen, this will certainly stop it. Therefore, just use as an added safety precaution. So this fabric here will cover the bungee cords and that will help to keep the nice, clean, fresh look for this simulator. So the artificial turf used in front of the hitting mats provides a perfect surface if you wish to practice your putting. It's gonna allow the ball to roll just as it would on the green outside on the golf course. So just looking at the practice mat area, we have two different sections. This section here is slightly firmer, and then the middle section here is slightly softer. And benefits of that, that if you like practicing with your wooden tees, they'll go straight in and hold the ball there like that. And then if you are practicing irons, I recommend practicing off this part. For a couple of reasons, the slightly softer mat will absorb the impact and so be less stress on your wrists and your joints. The mat is also very durable, so it can withstand up to 30 to 40,000 shots. And then when you do see some wear and tear, they're easily replaceable. So each section of the practice mat is gonna be held in place with the Velcro system. Therefore, this is gonna provide a very stable base for you when you're practicing. Welcome to the Personal Golf Simulator Studio, a professional, accurate, and fun way to practice indoors.